Hey you guys, it's Sadie, and I wanted to show you, uh, well, I, I made this too, this little heart thing. It's just a kit, but you can see how many, um, you can see how many um, lights are on there. So I had to solder all those on there, and they just look like this, these little, you know, LED lights. But these are the ones that are voltage controlled. So um, they're in different they're in different colors based on the voltage. That was a kit from IC Station that I got off Amazon. Now uh, from Electronic Gold Mine, I got this. Um, now first I built this one, which is um, a binary counter. So what it does is it does it does it counts in binary like one, two, three, and it does that. But then you can also get, so you can see the diagram for it. Um, it has um, two ICs in it, a 40, 93, and a 40, 24, and then some resistors and stuff, and jumpers and lights. And it's, um, it just counts like one, and then two, and then three is two and one, and then four. And then five is four and one. And, you know, if you probably are watching my channel, you know what binary is. So it's so cool. So it counts all the way up um, in these lights. And so they, the lights are all red. And you know me, I got to put different colors in there. So I made it right here. Um, nine volt battery in there. I use this case. And I put my own switch on it, but um, I, I then I then later on I got this kit, and I couldn't get it to work, and I was so frustrated. And it it basically goes with the other kit, and I was like, well, I don't need to use the other one; it can still work. But it really does go with it. So this one, it has a. Each time it gets a pulse, it moves up these these um, these numbers right here. So when you connect it to the other kit, it shows the the binary number there. So I changed out all the red ones. See how they're all red? I think that's boring. So I have tons of whites, you guys. Like just ridiculous. Um, they're they're so cheap. Um, so, yeah, or some more lights. I don't know. You know, they're just cheap lights. Um, you know, it's like there some lights. There's some more. They're just ridiculously cheap. Um, but some of the cooler ones do this. Some of the cooler ones are voltage controlled like that, but you know, that wouldn't work in this kit because it's not set up for that. Okay, so when we turn it on, and, and the, there's just four wires that go across here, uh, positive and negative, and a count and a reset. I couldn't figure out, I couldn't figure out why it works, and then and there's all these jumpers on it. Um, I put all these copper jumpers. That's supposed to be there. But this is just those two, a resistor, Two, those two are the same, and then that one like um, decodes it, and then these two control that. So as the pulses come in, um, this one counts in this one counts in, and it goes to each one of these, and then these two control each one of those. Okay, I'll show you how it it is now. Now keep in mind, I did put other colored lights in there, and I got this from Electronic Gold Mine. So you can see that is so cool. So it's counting in binary across there and it's hard to see because, okay, green is the 64 and you see we passed 64 already. But what it's doing is it's just counting across there just like this is, does. But I put the different colored lights in there um, that white light is is really bright, and I have a green for the 64. So each one has a different color. Oh, I wish I could show this a little bit better if I get back like this. 
And then this shows the number of it. And you can see how fast it's going. And, and I guess I could slow it down. Or you could make it, like if you had a door that was opening, like if you had a door that was opening, you could have it so each time the door opens, it would be, it would go, you know, count one and count over there. And then you could have these this in another room with these wires. So, um, you know, you could do a lot of things with this, with this kit. Um, you know, anything from um, anything that like kind of counts things. If if you had a into like in in some kind of factory or something, it had like if you had a little switch that counted products as they went through. But I think this is just so cool. I wanted to put these other these other lights on here that I got, but they are too. I wanted to put these on there. These have the pins on the sides, and then these have the pins on the top, like four pins on the top and four on the bottom. These have four on the each side, but you can see that these are bigger anyway, so that's not going to work. But I just want to make a quick video about this, and then I put that, that together too. That one, of course, when you get kits off Amazon, especially from IC Station, all it comes with is a QR code for you to scan in. But, you know, you can figure this out. Let me turn it off. Okay, like, so there's just the small lights in there, then the big lights around the heart, and then there's just two diodes, a resistor, a switch, and then that's for, um, that is for like a little, like a remote control thing for it. And then under this huge IC is a crystal, um, one of the crystal um, uh, oscillators. It's just has the two pins on it. And then two small capacitors. So there's not really much, you can figure that out. You know, the long lead on each one of these is the positive, and there was a little plus where it was supposed to be. It's just very time consuming. Um, what else do I have? I have this thing that I was working on, but I have, I don't know how. And then this I redid too. Let's turn this off. It's running it down. This is, a, it's not working now. I broke it. I took it apart, but it had these, it had like really generic switches there. So I took it apart to put these switches on there because I like them better. They were a lot better than the, they just had like a, like a stick switch. And then it, whatever, it was just, but I cannot, I think I, I don't know, it's not working at all. But it's, it was pretty cool. So, um, there we go, and I'm watching Mr. Carlson. Where is he? Okay, whatever. Um, well, so I just wanted to show you guys that. Um, but I think it's so cool. The back of it looks like that. Um, these things are kind of, you know, they're not really expensive, but they're a little more expensive than the stuff you get from Amazon, which isn't that bad because these kits are, I forget how much they were, but it's, they weren't really like expensive, expensive, like $12 or something. But, um, the stuff you get off Amazon is a lot cheaper, but it has no instructions and you can see how nice these instructions are. Like you're never going to see instructions better than, than from this company. Um, oh, there's a QR code too, but it, it explains it so much so well. You would not need, you know, you can troubleshoot it. You can, um, it tells you all the pitfalls and then there's the binary one, but it looks like the battery is running down. I wonder why that is. Oh, I've been using it a lot. So so I wanted to just show you guys my stuff that I was making. There's some more stuff. This is supposed to be a. This is supposed to hook up.